Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and click on all bell icon to receive notifications for our upcoming videos. As promised, I am here to answer your questions. Also, I will announce winner for our very first Q&A vlog. Are you ready to receive your prizes? Let's begin taking up the questions. So the very first question most people ask and they want to know is uh, what is AJ? A is Anuj and J is Jyotsna. So this is Anuj. Very creative and supportive, the most important pillar for ANJ craft. And I am J Jyotsna. So another question that a viewer asked was how are you having such new ideas amid this dark COVID situation and would love to see some anti-COVID Santa reindeer innovation. So this anti-COVID Santa and reindeer innovation part is already done on request and the link is also provided in description box. This pandemic has made people feel depressed, alone and also building up negative thoughts. It is always good to channelize your thoughts or energy towards something positive or productive. For me, crafting is like meditation and it helps me feel relaxed. So guys, moving on to the next question. Are you a housewife or a working woman? You are inspiring so many people. I'm glad to know that. Thank you so much for your kind appreciation. And you love all of them. इतने सारे लाइक्स करते हैं, कमेंट्स करते हैं, that keeps me going, that keeps me motivating. Yes, I have been working since I completed my education along with my crafting passion. So one asked, how did you get ideas to start and manage ANG crafts? Then there was another one. May I know the source of ideas and inspirational stuff? How do you get so many interesting ideas along with being super busy with work and family? I see art in everything. My mother has a very creative mind. Since childhood, we have been creating crafts by reusing waste materials. Nature is my biggest inspiration and God is a great artist. Leaves, trees, rivers, sea. Everything is so beautiful and there is art everywhere. Craft is my passion that keeps me going. I try to complete my tasks as soon as I can to create something interesting and share with you all. So Ayushi Taneja has asked, have you ever sold your crafts at a craft fair or craft show? If so, what did you sell? Secondly, what is your number one tip for organizing craft supplies? Yes, I got chance to sell my handcrafted products at a Diwali event organized in my previous organization and I was able to craft and sell uh, wooden frames, some uh, wall hangings, some handcrafted planters, some hand painted planters. So tip for managing craft supplies. I myself uh, struggle a lot managing my craft supplies. Uh, but I usually use containers and uh, categorize them by naming them like glitters, pens, paints, brushes. So the next question is, uh, do you have any plans to start online classes? Yes, of course. If the time and resources allow and there, there are groups of some passionate students to learn, then I would love to. One more question. आप सब कैसे मैनेज कर लेती हैं आपका तो एक छोटा बेबी भी है आई ट्राई टू प्रायोरिटाइज थिंग्स एंड वर्क हार्डर टू अचीव माई गोल्स येस हमारी एक छोटी सी प्यारी सी बेटी है तो ऐशा जो लोग हमें ऑलरेडी फॉलो करते हैं उन्होंने उसे कुछ वीडियोज़ में देखा भी होगा अगर आप उसके बारे में और जानना चाहते हैं तो उसके इंस्टाग्राम का लिंक मैंने डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में दिया है यू कैन फॉलो हर एंड वहाँ आपको बेबी फोटोग्राफी आइडियाज एंड टॉडलर फोटोग्राफी आइडियाज भी मिलेंगे सो द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज डू यू थिंक होम क्राफ्ट आर अंडर रेटेड 
yes they are underrated and there are different reasons for this different artists put different amount of efforts and different level of skills to create their products market has poorly made crafts which are sold at cheaper rates due to which skillful artists are not much appreciated and recognized next question is have you ever experienced parker sudden darkness while recording by god's grace this never happened with me but it may happen with anyone and we should always be creative enough to handle the situation so era asked how do you manage to get it done also while shooting the video what if suddenly someone calls you in between maybe your kid then do you reshoot the whole video again or how do you handle the first question is already answered and for the second one i must say that uh, a few disturbances like someone calling me over the phone when i'm using my phone camera for recording or dogs barking in background or some uh, street vendor shouting so in such cases i don't reshoot my videos again there are editing apps that i use at times it may happen that editing a video involves more time than actually creating a craft a video of 3 minutes that you watch is actually created in 3 hours and after cutting splitting merging and a lot more the duration was reduced it involves a lot of effort in creating a craft recording it then editing a video and uh, bringing it to you so on this note i request you all again to like this video comment on it share it with your friends so that they can also watch this and if you have not yet subscribed subscribe now with the all bell icon so that you can receive all the notifications for our upcoming craft ideas also i always try to make my kiddo go asleep uh, before i start creating a video so that i do not get distracted and i do not have to reshoot the whole video again so we have a list of questions from a viewer and a few of them have already been answered so i'll take the remaining ones how did you get idea to start ang crafts so it was like since childhood i was requested by my cousins friends neighbors to draw diagrams or uh, their drawings in their school projects they people consulted me for different uh, party decoration ideas handmade craft ideas card making ideas then they also consulted me from for classroom decoration ideas they asked me to prepare their uh, charts for classroom decoration and um, i started taking pictures of the things i created or the drawings i have made and then uh, my colleagues uh, from my previous organization they asked me to create my own youtube channel and this is how i was pumped up and i created one video and uploaded it uh, they applauded me they appreciated me initially i could not get enough time to create stuff and uh, also i was not equipped with the recording instrument so i was not able to regularly create some craft items or upload it on youtube so i was not uh, very much paying attention to my youtube channel due to which i was lagging behind another question is if you get a chance to craft live in front of large audience uh, which craft and what location you would love to choose uh, this would depend on the target audience or the event on which i am being performing or uh, showcasing my talent in front of the large audience but if i get a chance to select any art then i will select mandala course um, also i will choose a riverside or a beach location for the same because with that we will be able to meditate as well so guys that's it all done and uh, this is the time to announce winner of the day winner of our first q and a vlog and this is none other than ang shrivastava he asked six six questions and also uh, he is our regular viewer and keeps providing his valuable feedbacks so thank you so much ang for watching and sharing your feedback with us 
so and she will receive your prize soon and we are also giving away ANJ crafts goodies to all the participants please stay tuned for more craft ideas and keep crafting with AJ